Hey guys, it's Sarah Taylor. Um, I'm going to do a couple of bloom swipes and I'll show you my colors. That's Quidacridone Nicolazzo Gold um, mixed with a bit of carbon black. And then that's actually a mica powder from Hippie Crafter, Burnt Umber mixed with some Burnt Umber by Charvin. And that is a color called Violet Ash, another Charvin acrylic paint. Uh, and that's, I think it's mostly golden fluid turquoise. There's a few other paints in there as well. And that's Charvin Indigo. And then this is golden fluid pearl, iridescent pearl. And I've got that base coat. I actually tinted it a very, very light pink. Um, and there's a little preview of the painting. I'm actually doing two paintings here. So I'm using the same very, very pale pink base coat for each painting. And yeah, I'm kind of continuing this um, kind of wing. I'm calling it moth wings. It's just this composition just really reminds me of, of like a winged little creature of some sort, <laughs> um, a moth. Some people have said um, like a pterodactyl or so, you know something prehistoric almost. So yeah, I just have really been enjoying this this process and just playing with different colors and different base coat uh, pillow colors and things like that. So uh, the second painting I do add um, a little bit of magenta and then I believe I used another darker paint that went down first on the second painting. And yeah, uh, thank you for, for being here and supporting my work. Uh, it means so much. And uh, I did want to mention, I've got a, an Amazon shop where I've kind of filled it with all of a lot of the supplies that I use, at least everything that I buy from Amazon. So I buy a lot from there. And then I also buy a lot of things from Jerry's Artorama as well, is where I get a lot of my paints and canvases and things like that. All right, take great care. Um, yeah, there's links below to all sorts of different beautiful ways you can support me. And just being here is a great support. So thank you and have a beautiful day and take great care. Bye. You should know I'm not like others. You should know I'm not the one. If you trust me with your feelings. You wanna run Only in my dreams, only in my dreams I play fair, I don't make you leave Oh, oh my god Why is it so hard to love? Only in my head, only in my head I'm the person I should be instead Oh, oh my god I'm too rough around the edges I'm so unrefined
Hey, so I thought I'd talk a little bit more about this technique. Um, just watching through the video, I wanted to explain a few things. So uh, I'll put the recipes below, but basically what I'm using for my pillow is just a house paint. Um, I've been using Glidden Ultra White, just it's like a latex, regular latex white house paint. And um, I add GAC 800 into that, probably about, I don't know, maybe an eighth part. Um, so seven parts house paint to maybe one part GAC 800. And then probably about another part of water just to thin it down um, to like, I always say warm honey, and that's really what it reminds me of. Um, like maybe three mounds when you're holding your stick up an inch or two. Um, so that's the base. And then uh, the colors, I, as you've noticed, I use Charvin paint a lot. Um, the pigment holds really well. I, I don't use a whole lot of pigments. Uh, I'm just not as into the glittery paint, like the shiny paint. I like to use some of the, the iridescent golden fluid colors along with these really rich acrylic paints um, to get some shine and iridescence into the painting. So, And then I mix those colors with um, two parts untinted house paint. And in this case, I'm using Bare 7300 untinted satin enamel. It's a base three paint. And then, um, so about two parts that to about one part polyurethane. Um, I like to use the Verithane triple thick or the Verithane um, crystal clear polyurethane. Water, you need to make sure to use the water-based. And yeah, and then I mix in um, about another part of the paint. And depending on the brand and which paint you're using, you know, you just want to make sure your pigments stay nice and rich. So I hope that helps. And um, much love you guys. Uh, come check, check me out on Instagram and thank you for being here. All right. Bye.